Well, with Halloween just weeks away now, candy, costumes, and pumpkins are popping up all over the place. But how do you know if you pick the perfect pumpkin? Reporter Cindy Shu from our sister station, CBS2 in New York, visited a New Jersey farm to find out. Welcome to Pumpkin Paradise at Norris Hill Farm in Hillsboro. This one's not watery and it's not that dirty, so I picked it. <laughs> there are more than 60 varieties here to choose from, coming in different colors and sizes, and they're all edible. Two year old Abigail wanted the perfect one. Do you like this one? Ew. Ew? <laughs> Okay, we can keep looking. I even met a two month old baby in the pumpkin patch. It's her first experience on a hayride and pumpkins, and she's sleeping through it. <laughs> there are thousands of pumpkins here at Norris Hill Farm, and all sorts of strategies on how to pick the very best one. Debbie Norris is the pro. Just look and feel it and make sure that there's no soft spots. You got a nice good stem, and you're ready to go. Well, the secret is to go all the way to the back of the farm where, you know, no one's going. So the best are back there. To help your pumpkin last, keep it in a cool spot. If you are going to carve it, I suggest waiting to about three days before Halloween. If you're gonna put it outside on your porch. And to protect the carvings, you wanna put it petroleum jelly all over where you carved it so that it helps it so that it doesn't start to cave in. Jacob Moody tells me he's all ready for Halloween. You have pumpkins? Yeah. And how did you pick them out? I I just pick gourds. You pick gourds? Yeah. And then I found some little ones who wanted to talk about other things. I'm four and a half. Okay. And I'm my name is Sanjita. Well, it's nice to meet you. My name is Cindy. Hi, Cindy. Hi. You want to say happy Halloween to the camera? Happy Halloween. That's why I love my job. In Hillsboro, Cindy Shue, CBS2 News.